I will take whatever's in you. Oh, okay, that works. Boop. Go. Alright, you know what? I don't really care about the seed guy, no offense to him, but I am way too many sexual in the windows in this already. Alright. So we're going to actually, you know, get back on this. Going to confront him. What are you going to do? I am here. Oh wow. Huh. Ah, this looks pretty identical. Hello. Hmm? Yo, hello there. Uh, you are there, aren't you? Hey, forgive yeah. my confusion. So hard to tell these days. Uh, you seem familiar somehow. I'm guessing uh, you're here for your brain, perhaps? Uh, it's Wait, my brain? There. Uh, such a nice brain, young, very bright. A uh, little hard to see you. Uh, can you walk into my left, uh, uh, right FOV cone? Okay. Ah, that's it. Better? You're coming into focus nicely. Lovely. Uh, is that better? Depth perception is a problem with this old monitor of mine. Went black a while ago. <laughs> uh. That's old age for you. <laughs> Should look at getting the visual nerves reattached. It's just that the right eye would see the wrong things. The <laughs> flying tortoises <laughs> were the worst. Oh, I know that. Would you care for a mentat? Uh, thanks. I'll, I'll actually, I'll save it for later. Mm, I love mentats. Delicious and smarty. Yes, indeed. I have all sorts of amazingly science-horrific thoughts and ideas when those chalky talents are zipping through my bio gel. Uh huh. I forget them all not long after, though, especially with the data constipating my memory core. Afraid binary streams might shoot out my chassis. Had to start using the dome floor and walls here to inscribe equations. Although I've somewhat lost track of where they start and end. Oh, that... Yeah, you aren't exactly what I was expecting. Really? That implies preconceived notions, theories, and a hypothesis about this meeting? Please extrapolate. What was I uh, supposed to be like? Uh... After all, it might be worth a cognitive realignment if your theoretical Mobius is better than I. <laughs> uh... I need my brain back. Do you? You seem fine without it. I guess. And does it even want to go back with you? Maybe you should ask it. It's hmm. quite independent. Has all manner of opinions. Do yeah. Tell you what. I'll leave it up to your brain. If it wants to go, then fine. If not, well, you should respect its wishes. Alright, well, that was... A Curious about some things. No oh, curiosity. Now, I, know. I experienced that Why not? now that I know everything. Oh, maybe it was when I found out some unpleasant answers. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I can't fix it, but if you're getting ghost reception, I can help out with that, you know. The ghosts aren't real? Oh. That changes everything. Why, I can save my computing power for other perceptual impossibilities. Please be my guest. Uh, the receptor is there. And the side switching wobbly bob, uh, just turn that. Okay. Good. Good. Uh, Better. Uh? Oh. oh. Oh, yes. That feels wonderful. This is even better than my afternoon mentats break. Oh, that's good. Uh, you, yeah, you don't seem that aggressive. Oh, I was probably tripping hard on Psycho when I sent that. Had to work myself up to it. Not usually violent, except when I am. Then, <laughs> watch out! <laughs> so many chems, such varieties. 
Whenever I take Mentats, I can feel my entire chassis breathe like a big spherical lung. That's <laughs> nice. Okay, you might want to calm As down. For that. The psycho, sometimes get the chem dispositories in my tank all switched up. Go in the wrong tube. Still served its purpose. Yeah. Then I was at, uh, right, time for me to go. You know. Indeed. The uh, goodbye part of our little chat then. Uh, goodbye. Uh, please mind the equations on the floor. Yeah, don't worry. Still don't really see a reason why I should kill him. But you. Uh, brain tank. Hello? Hi! That's my brain! Can I talk to you? Well, well, look who finally dragged themselves in out of the wasteland. And where have we been? Hmm? Crawling through pits of radioactive muck again? Okay, Stewie, come on. <laughs> Are you my brain? Ah, lovely. Figure that out, have we? Would you like a cookie? Wow, that... <laughs> <laughs> There's no need to be sarcastic. I mean, your own brain is slightly out of bent. Yeah. Yes, well, believe me, the opposite is equally true. Good lord, have you bathed at all since they pulled me out of you? Oh, calm down. Yes, because running around... <laughs> yes, because running around a crater full of bizarre science experiments, hygiene is t top priority. Well, I see sarcasm hasn't eluded you. Well, of course yes, not. Perhaps now isn't the best time, but it's the principle of the thing. Yeah. So, I wanted, I wanted to talk about... Of course you do. How scintillating. Now, calm down. How did he get a hold of my brain? After the think tank extracted me from your skull, they fell to bickering amongst themselves. I'm sad to say we were quite forgotten about. Oh? Dr. Mobius saw an opportunity to gain some leverage and had me spirited away to his dome. Uh-huh. How did he manage that? I don't know. Yeah. I'm afraid the trauma of our separation rendered me quite insensate. I didn't come uh -huh. around until I was safely ensconced in this tank. Uh -huh. I'm quite sure whatever he did was highly scientific, though. Uh, you know, uh, seems like an unlikely coincidence, but Hardly. coincidence. Dr. Mobius keeps a close optical sensor on the goings-on at the think tank. No. As soon as he saw the opportunity, he took it. Not bad. Well, answers that. Well, as long as your curiosity is satisfied. Are you my brain? Yeah, okay, uh... Listen, you're my brain, you better be more oh, respectful. What exactly will you do if I don't? Not put me back in that cranial dungeon you call your head? Dun Dun dungeon! <laughs> no, what the fuck? Dungeon? Uh, I could smash this tank. By all means, if the idea of spending the rest of your days as a true lobotomite appeals to you. Oh. Actually, come to think of it, you probably wouldn't mind that, would you? Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, why are you such a dick? Well, that's a fine how do you do. Me, a, quote, dick, unquote. And if I'm the one responsible for the way you carry on gadding about the waste. Technically you are. I'm not the one that makes us clamber around technus-infested ancient vaults or go charging off to New Vegas on missions of ill-conceived revenge. Hey. And have we forgotten who got us shot in the head and buried in a shallow grave? Hmm? Do you think I enjoy that little moment? <laughs> I didn't realize it caused you, yeah. Well, maybe next time you hear me telling you that charging a knifekin with a pen knife is a bad idea, you listen. Well, so, don't you, I thought you would be, yeah. I'm not going to lie to you. The prospect is definitely not that appealing. Okay. Look at it from my perspective. Here I have peace. Quiet and safety. Well, that's true. Well, barring the odd rogue scorpion. I guess. In your head, I've got poison, radiation, grisly injuries, and biological functions. Oh, shut up. Do you know how much more you can get done when you're not constantly looking for places to urinate? It's quite a lot, I can tell you. Ah, uh, that's good. Uh, yeah, what about the good things? Yeah. What about the good things? Overrated biological feedback. Believe me. You only feel that way because you've got all that meat oozing hormones. Oh. Isn't it true? Yeah. Hmm. 
I suppose you're right. That does call certain assumptions into question, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, so we're at an impasse. You can't feel what I feel, and I can't think the way you think. Indeed. Quite the conundrum. How do you suppose we resolve it? Uh... I think we have to trust each other and acknowledge that we aren't complete if we're separate. Uh, hmm. Maybe we can keep thinking of going like this. Um, what? I, I think we should, you know. You mean I'll stay in my tank and you'll stay in your skin? And we'll each handle our own areas of expertise? I mean, pretty much, yeah. I certainly like the sound of that. That's good. Uh, so, yeah, I, I have been, I would say I have been, I have been a little unfair. It's not that I didn't like being in your head, you understand. As far as heads go, it was a rather nice one. Well then, I suppose this is goodbye for now. What will you do? Uh, I guess I'll, uh, yeah, may as well explore. Still got some stuff to do. Will you take some free advice from your brain? Don't trust the think tank. They are right. In the brain, I mean. Yeah. They're fiercely protective of their technology, and none of them is likely to share it with Ah, I wonder what that sounds like. Uh... Why? They promised to put us back together once I did what they wanted. And you believe them? Really? Sure. I know you were recently <laughs> fabulous advice, but... Really? Once I'm delivered into their clutches, they'll find a way past the radar fence and the whole Mojave will be their playground. And uh... that is assuming, of course, that one of them doesn't take a fancy to our body and decide to slip his own brain into it instead. True. Uh, yep. <laughs> uh, so... <laughs> So let's see, so you're part of me, I don't want you to let that happen anymore. Well, I suppose I do miss those endorphin rushes when we save the day. Alright, what's the plan? Uh, I'll handle the brains, you stay here, you'll... Yeah, yeah, I mean... You know, I'll handle them. That arrangement suits me fine. Do try not to get too many holes drilled in your head, will you? I may want to drop by for sentimental reasons. Don't right worry. Then. You'd best be off, hadn't you? The think tank will be waiting. No. no, don't worry about me. When you're gone, I'll flush myself over to the sink. It's amazing how far you can get in this place with a good flush. I'll keep myself hidden in the ductwork. Klein won't suspect I'm inside the dome, so he won't know the pacification field no longer works on us. I can also upgrade the sink's autodock with the procedures to reinstall your heart and spine, assuming you want all that flesh and gristle back. With any luck, I'll see you in the sink when this is all over. Awesome. Great. <sighs> sink auto dock to retrieve your original heart. Our spine. Well, I mean, technically, I would... Mm, I wouldn't go for that. Anyway. Ow. Checked. Hi, giant robo. You're cute. Alright, well, it looks like this is what we're gonna do. No, I honestly, when he makes that point, when I... What, technically, could you can kind of consider yourself you making your own point? I mean, think about it. You literally are, if you're, you know, if your brain's doing it. So, am I wrong? Huh? Would I be wrong? Oh, no. Whatever. Let's continue on. Alright, first off, we are actually going to do some field research. Because I kind of want to see how many we need. How many do we actually need? Oh wow, that's actually not that far. That That's actually really good. <laughs> I thought, I honestly thought it was going to be like, Oh yeah, we're going to have like 10 hundred of them. Didn't think there would be three. I wouldn't mind that. I actually, I mean, they're all here, I think, in the canyon. If I can remember. If not, then oh well. That's just... I mean, like, when you think about it, 
technically... Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, that one even work. Hold on. I just realized something. I need to get out this. Baby, and... Sh shit, where are you? There. Awesome. Alright, now, what am I looking for? Is it up here? Oh, activate seed package. Oh, okay. So I'm looking for seed packages. Okay, okay. That's good. At least, at least it's not like, oh yeah, you have to find like each single like item, or you're fucked. All right, let's go to the Signal Hills transfer. Maybe we can like find a seed package nearby. I uh, assume that we can. Usually we could. Maybe it's up here. Well, there's one right here. Ah, there you go. Yoink. Then we're going this way. Something over here. Almost forgot. I don't trigger those. Okay. Looks like we got them. Great. There we go. We got them all. That works. That was quick. <laughs> I mean... Do I actually travel up to the sink balcony? If I do, that's awesome. Then, like, holy shit, that works so well. Oh my god. It's actually been a while since I looked from there. I just realized. No, because you never really go up there. You never expect your life to be up there, you know? Never do. You get what I'm saying? And apparently the game is saying fuck you to me. Wonderful. Yep, it just said go fuck yourself. Lovely! Fuck my. Alright. So, yep, yeah, we're back. And um, we'll, we'll look at it a little more. But now, we will go to you. What's that? I got some, uh. Got a new file for you. Awesome! Robo Scorpion. I actually want it. Uh, not, not that. I want you to recalibrate Gabriel's bark into the Robo Scorpion, because that's actually pretty badass. That's you. That's you. All right. I like the mu. The, I love the music. I always love the music. You got some plans for me, don't you? Yeah, I can smell it all. Yeah, I do actually. Uh. I command you to open your port and receive my <laughs> Wow. Oh, yeah, baby. Just slip it in there. All the way down in that dark, moist That... Mm, if there's no Rule 34 of this shit, then that's fucking hilarious. Alright. Did all that. Awesome. The field research is complete. Uh, what else? I think I have everything. Any more? Oh, there's a toaster. Apparently not. Apparently... The only thing is, I have to finish it up. You require some additional... Uh, yeah. Mm. Initiate. Swap body parts. Uh, no. I never had any of the perks, though. That's the thing. 